What's going on, Falcons fans? It's me, J.R. Clark, back again with another Pound for Pound ATL. Uh, this time we're doing something a little different, uh, something a little exciting. A bunch of the Falcons content creators have come together to do like a video chain, you know, uh, a video chain that takes place of, of like a pep rally type situation. Uh, we're putting it out there on what we think the Falcons are going to do, not what we uh, hope they do, not what we want them to do, what we think is going to happen. And it's a video that's not just for the fans, you see. This is also a plea to the the brass, the the uh, Falcons front office, the, the brain trust that's up there at Flowery Branch. I'm speaking to you, Terry F. Baby. I mean, come on. We have been waiting, right? We have been waiting. We're picking at number eight for the third time, no, fourth time in a row. No, third time in a row. Man, I'm so like jazzed and jacked that I'm, I'm forgetting how many times in a row we've been in this spot. And what I'm talking about is like, like uh, some, you know, some of the other creators up the chain have mentioned, like we have picked some really good offensive weapons some really unicorn style weapons some generational talents if you will some grown men at wide receiver if you will and the temptation's going to probably be there again it's going to be there to get that Roma Dunze it's going to be there to get that Malik neighbors but I implore you Terry I implore you uh Kyle Smith I implore y'all Ryan uh Poles up there I implore y'all, not polls, I think it's Ryan Pace, anyway, to resist the urge, resist the temptation, resist the temptation and it will flee. I need y'all to look beyond that shiny Ferrari, look beyond that, that rocket, that crotch rocket out there in the, in, in the driveway. And I need y'all to look for that physical beast, that, that Mack truck type vehicle that Mack truck type situation i need y'all to hone in on the player that's going to strike fear in opposing quarterbacks that teams are going to have to game plan for we haven't had a Mack truck prowling the sidelines since number 55 john abraham the predator was on the sidelines we've tried and ain't for the lack of trying i know Y'all spent a first on Tack and a first on Vic. I get it. Those guys didn't work out. One had some injuries and one's heart just wasn't in it. But this year is a, is a chance to hit again. You got to keep swinging until you get one, right? That's what we say about QBs. Why not about the guys who chase the QBs? Why not about the guys who strike fear in the hearts of the QBs? Keep swinging until you get one. I know y'all been trying. Y'all went after Hunter. You went after Sweat. I get it. So you know the need is real. The time is now. The time is nigh. It, it's there. We got to do it. We got to strike for it. Now, whether it's you trading back or whether it's you selecting at eight, I think you need to come away with a Dallas Turner. That's what I think. That's what I feel in my heart that you're going to do. That you're going to come away with that Dallas Turner. That versatile, freaky athlete who can bend, who can drop into coverage, who can set a hard edge even for a guy his size, whose comp is close to a Brian Burns. Y'all would love to have had a Brian Burns, right? I know I would have. Like, so come on, Terry, you got to do it. Not just for y'all, but for us, the fans. We need it. We need some guy who's going to strike fear in the hearts. We need that that T.J. Watt that we could have had. Everybody knows we could have, but y'all went a different direction. Y'all went with an injured UCLA defensive end. I mean, I'm not, I'm not trying to throw stones, but I'm just saying you could go get that go get that dude from Alabama, the dude who played in the SEC, the vaunted SEC. Come on, guys. Y'all know y'all can do it. Anyway, folks, like I said, this is a, a video chain, a content creator chain. So next up, I need y'all to, to check out the video from, from my boys over there, the Atlanta Bird Gang. Uh, they're bringing up their, their picks. I appreciate Smitty for setting me up. Thank you. I appreciate y'all. And as always, we'll see y'all live 
Tuesday, 7.45 p.m. right here on the channel as we'll be talking the whole time about who we pick. As always, Falcons fans, 